Good day, folks. We are back. Some more Xenonauts, too. Fortunately, I haven't had another save breaking patch. <laughs> but I'm sure more will be coming out soon. This dev team is relentless, brutal in their pursuit for release. I love it. But let's continue. I think our last mission was a successful defeat of a raid. Got our aircraft being rebuilt. Other bases uh, going strong in the Southeast Asian Pacific. Specific Pacific. And we will, let's see. I guess we'll just let that keep going. How are our soldiers doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. Let's get them back to base. Alright, we got the autopsy on the civilian. Big bastards. No new projects. Let's continue. How are our Joes doing? Take a look at our forces here. Let's run down the line. That's right, you can't see if they're wounded there, so we'll check here. We'll get a couple of wounded. Not bad, though. Not bad. Still got a full ship. We didn't lose anybody on that mission. Going strong. People are starting to get a little, speaking of strong, starting to get stronger and able to carry more shit. Take a look at our inventory here. Got smoke grenades still. How are we doing on equipment? He's good. Fucking all handsy here. First to capture an enemy alien. Supposed to an enemy human. <laughs> Don't really have something like Exalt in here. Like uh, they did in XCOM 2. Well, actually, no. XCOM 1, the Firaxis one. Not 2. Enemy youth in? I think it was that, that expansion. Okay, we got some more missions on the board. Let's send noobs out. Eric Holmgren, you're going. Mark Phillips, get the fuck out of here. Mr. Double Dots, Christopher, you're out. You're going to Canada, boyo. Alexi. Not not our Alexi, the uh, other Alexi. Replacement Ale Alexi. Let's just advance time a little faster. Hey, we got improved armor. Let's come in here if we have no projects yet. Uh, let's get the interceptor plating going. Check out engineering. They are busy as fuck. But, queue up another project. And that ate up all our money. Fortunately, we're coming to the end of the month. So we should be getting more money. Speed it up a little bit. Hey, there we go. Oof. Got some changes going here. Still made a good chunk of change. Expenses took a lot out of our budget. Take a look at that real quick. Personnel upkeep is uh, crushing us right now, but it's fine. It's fine. We need all that. Good, we're up to 1.3 million. Cool. We'll have enough to outfit this base pretty quick as soon as it's good to go. Just need that generator to finish. Pfft, speak of the devil. Let's put an engineer there. Let's get us a living quarters. We'll get a storeroom. We'll get a radar array. Rot her. Another hangar. I think I want to put the other... Uh, yeah, let's get another hangar. No, we can't yet. We're going to have to wait. But we'll get two interceptors here, and then we'll get a Skyhawk down here so we don't have to fly as far. Um... We'll get a medical room. That's it. We're done spending money on this place. For now. That's a struggle in there for some reason. I feel like I'm going to need more. Let's get another scientist for our med bay coming up. Take a look at our main base. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. This is almost filled out. Okay, what's next? 
Let's research uh, Elenium. The Elenium Falcon. Hmm. Maybe get a copyright strike on here. Well, too bad. I don't make money anyways. I am not monetized. Yet. Not yet. A little tough to rely on any kind of ad revenue on YouTube. Since they have some Orwellian rules going into effect. Can't have wrong think. And boy. Boy do I have some wrong think compared to these guys. Can't be a freedom loving individual. Speaking of freedom loving, old Minoru here. His accuracy is up to 71. He's gonna be pretty good with that fucking uh, saw. Same with Chris Taylor. That's weird. Like, how do they. Their accuracy is skyrocketing. I am taking a lot of shots with them, though. How many Joes do I have here? We'll get enough to outfit another Skyhawk eventually. Oh, cool. That is done. Let us. Now, I think this only builds one. Actually, I'm not going to build anything. I'm going to let these engineers catch up to what they're fucking doing. Maybe I should be getting some engineers out of here. I'll do that. Start replacing them. And he's back. Good. Falcon 3 is ready to rock. We have three interceptors here. This one's under construction. Now I'm debating, should I put my... I think I'm going to put the uh, Foxhounds over here. Let's go ahead and relocate this aircraft for now. Uh, okay. How about you? Apparently I can't put that over there. That's very interesting. Well, okay, I guess that, that narrows it down, doesn't it? Transferring that one over there. Cool, we got medical. We'll put one medic here. Or one scientist, rather. Alright, we got a UFO. Oh, it's a fighter. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, let's give her a go. We'll see what happens. Oh, nice. Nicely done, boys. Shit, yeah. I thought we were going to get smoked there. I remember the fighters being really hard and Xenonauts won. Nope, we got an infiltrator. Oh, really? What is this? What is this? Observer. Huh. What can I launch him? Not him. Okay, well, never mind. No, I can't. But, yeah, that's different. I don't think I've ever remembered seeing that before. Mark Phillips, you're going back out. Cool, got a storeroom there. Check that out. Now we can put shit there. <laughs> no, I don't want to demolish it. Shit, come on. Come on. Alright, I think this base is nearly complete. We will move another fighter there, but first, actually, I want to... Oh, I really need more engineers. I've got so many projects going at once. It's this Foxon Interceptor that's been eating all their time. I need to get another Skyhawk going. Let's build it. We'll put it... Yeah, we'll put it in the Asia Pacific for now. Ooh, good, we got Elenium. Oh boy, <laughs> it's opening up a lot of research opportunities. Uh, I feel like I need to ramp up my weaponry for the air-to-air -air fight here coming up. Let's get another engineer going. I'm going to need more money soon. What do we finish? Hey, look, we got another uh, fighter. 
but I keep them there because they're centrally located. Although technically you can't really be centrally located on a globe. Unless you're in the center of the earth and that doesn't really help. Got radar. Got all this fun shit. I can't really afford a hangar right now. I guess I can. Let's do it. I'm gonna take money. Good. I'm getting better. Getting shit done now. Now that that thing's fucking done. Um, who's got a lot of extra weight? Victoria Phillips. Guess what? Have a breaching charge. Get rid of your grenade. Oh, we got an alien raid. Let's send the team. Skyhawk 1. Ready to rock. We handled that last raid pretty good. Okay, let's launch. We will send... Let's get our Foxhounds in the fight. Yeah, we'll send one of the Falcons too. Nice. Took her down. What can I do? Can airstrike it. Yeah, let's blow that thing up right now. I'm sure it had good tech. I just don't have the people to deal with it just yet. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really have the guys ready. We'll send this guy in too. Let's do the mission. It's getting a little busy on the world map here. One of the mechanics I think is kind of missing on this, in most of these games, they, they try to incorporate it with like will and fatigue, but the immense pressure on like a special operations team like this, just the individual people like day in and day out having to get after it. Oh fuck, those guys. I think that's an important facet that gets overlooked. I don't care what nationality you are. If you're getting after it at a high rate of speed all the time for years and years on end, you do have a breaking point, no matter how badass you are. Let's step out real quick. Get on his downrange. Same thing with our sniper. Get a good firing line going here. Were they on top of each other? That was... Well, that's weird. <laughs> that's just weird. Alright, I want you to push up there, big buddy. What do we got? What the fuck is that? Oh, we're taking cover. Oh my god. <laughs> this is interesting. Oh! Shit! Well, I'm gonna have him just pop a squat there. You can't hit shit. Now you can, maybe. Give her a go. Okay. Oh, I'm missing all my portraits again. Joys of Planet Alpha. Alright, we're just gonna go into Overwatch mode here. I feel bad for these uh, civilians that are out there. Don't get a little, uh, oh, that thing's gonna be nice. Nice, take the shots. Light him up. Oh, he sounds like a human. Yeah, take him out. Come on. That sounds brutal. <laughs> Fucking hand cannon there. Blast and some. Oh, I gotta take those guys out. Those are new to me. I don't know. Who they are. Oh, who just died? We're basically just holding this <laughs> That's all we can do. I gotta fan out to cover and just take up these firing positions wherever I can. You need to get out of there, civilians. There ain't much I can do for you. Oh, 
Oh, are you fucking kidding me? <sighs> Shotgun point blank and he just eats it. What a dick. What a dick. Nice. Got him down. Good. At least that flank is kind of secure. You two are going to hold. Good. That one's down. I'm going to have you push up. Take a shot on one of these dickheads. Just because I want rounds on target. Pushing you out. I need every weapon in the fight here. Okay, we're gonna hold. This uh, campaign is accelerating very quickly. Nice. Nice. Oh, good job, civilian. Good dodge. Oh, God, you're going to frag us, civilian. <laughs> what do we got? Jeez. Nice. Good shot. Good shot. <laughs> it's a good thing we got our A team on this. Oh, shit. I'm getting fragged. It's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt so bad. Don't, pink mist. Don't turn into pink mist. <laughs> See, I wish that hidden movement would go away. Okay, good. He didn't. He didn't mist. Come on, civilian. Get out of the drop zone. You can do it. You can make it. I have faith in you. You are not bleeding. Well, get to it. That's not getting to it. There you go. Good job. What gonna do with you? Push you up here and take a shot at him. Good hit. Who's got a shot? Well, you can take a crossfire shot. Good hit. I'll push you up here. What do you have for points? Can you frag this fucker? Do me a favor. Frag him. Don't frag yourself. Yeah, well. Close enough, I guess. Horseshoes and hand grenades and all that. You are going to push up. I need rounds on target and I need rounds at target. Saw that motherfucker. Good hit. I don't really want to push up too much. I'm a little worried about that flank. You guys are fine. You can't really take a shot. Can you take a shot on any of these guys? Not really. I want you to watch that flank. And we'll call it there. Hey, good. You got a hit? I'll take it. It's better than fragging yourself. Come on, civilian. You can make it back to the LZ. Oh, he's getting aggressive. I like it. Oh, that was like right in the face. Shit, that's right under my nuts. We're just... No, we lost. Hopefully he didn't pink mist. He did. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, this is, this is brutal. Yeah, get back here, civilian. 
You can fucking do it. You can just burst him. Good hit. Shoot to take some shots at him. Not shoot the aircraft. That's not good. You suck. If you push up a little bit. There goes his cover. You did something. I'll take something. Good hit. Nice. Dropped him. You can push up. Well, I guess that's better than nothing. <laughs> Not much better, but it is better than nothing. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh, fucking civilians. Wrong place, wrong time. That's my turn, I guess. Here comes the pucker factor. A little bit, a little concernicus here. It all depends on what they do. So he got aggressive. He missed, good. Oh, there's another one. These guys just keep coming out of the woodwork. Good. good misses, I like it. Alright. What can we do here? What are our options? You have a clean shot on him. You have a clean shot on him. Good. You might as well take a shot on him. That looked like a hit to me. Sometimes, man. Just don't... Good hit. Oh, better than nothing. Hmm. Don't like those odds. You can't really do shit there. You can do some shit there. Good job with the saw. Then you step out. Try to frag him. Good frag. Take the shot. Good hit. Number three. You watch that flank. You continue watching there. Still got that guy to worry about. That's about all we got, though. I don't want to overstretch myself. Nice. Nice. Seeing more ragdolls in this. That's awesome. Oh shit. Jeez. It's good to learn here, bro. Oh man. <laughs> this is getting a little a little rough. there. Just turn and fire. Good shooting. There's still more out there. I'll watch that flank. Go ahead and push up here. Watch this direction with the sniper and we'll just keep the overwatch going. another one <laughs> yeah good shot good shot we'll light him up and I think that'll be the mission three KIA now oh, you're out of ammo well guess what you can do mp5 that bad boy keep him suppressed Oh, 
until he's about as suppressed as you can get. <laughs> I take the shot. Nice. Good roll of the dice there. Well, that could have gone far worse. Got introduced to new aliens. Lost three, but we we prevailed. Oh, Hansy took one for the team. He's down. Minaru's down. Chad. Oh, Victoria's promoted to corporal, gained some accuracy. Petra's still uh, doing doing good. Adrian Thomas is now a smadge. Get Lieutenant Alexi. He's got two awards to his name. Lose one lieutenant, another person gets a battlefield commission. But mantids and wraiths, those are the new aliens we're dealing with. Interesting that the mantids aren't just melee, melee only. They are ranged as well. That surprised me. Not gonna lie. Apparently the local forces survived. That's good. I saw him go down, but I guess he was just wounded. But we'll use some of our recruits and uh, plus up Skyhawk One yet again, an RTB. But thanks for joining me. Catch you next time.